Hey guys, this is Faye from Face World Media. In this video, I'm going to show you brand new timers I designed, including Pomodoro timers, 25 minutes, followed by five minute and 15 minute breaks as a set. I also surveyed my customers to figure out the colors they would like to add to the timers they already have. So they told me the easy on the eyes colors, like a light yellow, blue, and green. I also added a what's called a count up timer. So instead of counting down, now we're counting up. Uh, so far, I've included a red one. Uh, so whenever you go over time, that's how it will work. So with that said, let's take a closer look at how to set it up and how they appear on the screen. Before we get started, I do want to mention that Zoom virtual backgrounds do come with requirements and limitations. So I'm going to list the requirement page below. If you're not sure, especially if you have an older MacBook Air or you have an older Windows machine, be sure to uh, review this link before you purchase the timers. But with that said, in case you purchase the timers by accident, or if you purchase the timers already, however, your uh, machines or your computers won't allow um, virtual timers or virtual videos, don't worry, I provide full refunds. If you're installing virtual video backgrounds for the first time, you're gonna go into video settings right here, click on the little up arrow and select video settings. Once you're here, it's better to have it on high def HD and make sure you select the best camera you have available, whether it's a webcam Maybe it's the built-in camera, that's your best option. But if you have upgraded to an external webcam, I highly recommend that. After that, you wanna make sure mirror my video is unchecked because otherwise it's gonna flip the video and make your timer look really strange. After that, you wanna go into background and filters. Right here, this is where you upload your timers after you purchase them. But let me go ahead and show you what the Pomodoro timers will look like. So I kept it really simple. So 25 minutes will start as soon as you start the timer. A lot of you guys ask, how do I pause it? Well, there is no ability within Zoom Virtual Backgrounds to pause the video because it's just a sort of a static video with no control over it. Pomodoro method, it's really not about pausing it or taking breaks until you, know, you meet the 25 minute mark. Speaking of which, I have created that as well. So if you're gonna take a short break, it's right there, you see how I uploaded all three of them? So you get all three in a pack. Now you're on your five minute break. So when you're on your break, you can actually use the restroom, grab something to drink if you want, or you know check your emails, but this is when you do that. Now, as I learned, Pomodoro methods also have a longer break, a 15 minute break. So if you need to stretch, you know, throw some yoga poses, run some errands, then you can actually set the 15 minute timer. I don't think people who are buying this are necessarily doing this for themselves. Maybe they are, but if you're running a group session with other people who are also using Pomodoro methods, or perhaps you are, you know, working for corporate and you're doing this, that makes sense to me and just enjoy it. Now, let me show you the next bestseller we have here. In addition to Pomodoro is this count up timer. Did you guys see what happened? Look at that. So, uh, there's a little artifacts flowing around over time. And then after that, it's really about counting up. And I put the over time there just for fun, but I think the idea is that it's very clear. Red indicates over time. And I threw a little yellow background behind the timer just to make it a little bit more friendly, funky, and make the letters kind of a little easier to read. And, you know, I know my head is covering the over time, but at the same time, I, I think we make it clear when we start and people should be ramping down at that point. So let me know how you like this and let me show you some of the other color timers as well. With all that said, as I'm doing this, I don't have a green screen, as you can see. Let's take a look at the yellow timers. So yeah, so this is a yellow timer. I try to pick colors that are easy on the eyes once again, so nothing too daunting or jarring, um, but these colors don't satisfy your needs. You have other um, preference, please let me know and maybe I can build some custom ones for you as well. Let's take a look at the blue ones. So this blue color is pretty similar to the Zoom Blue. That's kind of, you know, what inspired me to create this. Pretty straightforward and as always a green, but nothing too 
um, you know, lime green, too bright of a green. And I thought this one is really easy on the eyes. And um, yeah, so let me know in the comments below what you think. And please also know that I included our original timers, which are designed mostly in black and white. And they're just a really big variety, guys. I have timers as short as 30 seconds uh, to one minute, two minutes, all the way up to 90 minutes. I also sell a lot of these in packs. So for example, you get minute one through five for only $10, minute six to 10 for only $10. You can mix and match them. So one way to use these timers and mix and match them to create something really sophisticated, for example, you can start the green timer at say five minutes and you want to give the speaker, the presenter a minute warning. So you can switch over to say the yellow timer to say, now you can wrap it up, right? Yellow is friendly, but Hey, you know, it's yellow light. Let's make sure we wrap up in a minute. And when this person goes over, this is where we can switch right over to overtime. So this person can really try to, in the next 15 to 30 seconds, uh, I think you understand what I mean. And if you have any further questions and suggestions, I absolutely love them. Please leave in the comments below. And thank you so much. This is Faye from Faye's World Media. I absolutely love creating content on YouTube like this, creating my own digital products, making it really accessible by people from around the world. So I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye for now. Bye.